bench damage. Just could use this word of draws here. Let's attack. 40 damage. And then the bench damage comes through everywhere. And the draw. Bench knife. I can launch it here. I don't want to take extra damage, so I'm taking out this Mimikyu right now. And it will not trigger this spell tag. Because it got shot off by the ability and not normally. Oh, I am dead. Well, more dead. Bench damage is nothing when you have the hit points. How about brawl damage? Dude, we're supposed to be doing flare strike. And do brilliant flare again. I cannot die next turn. I think I'll join your team. We got bench damage. We got even more bench damage. And if it's hurt, it's probably not going to survive a flare strike. Oh yeah, 230. Basically, we're going to kick your ground type boots fire and poison. We'll let you go this time. Whoa! Well, hello to girls and the French shows. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. And on this menu, I'll be serving you a wheezing and bulk corn of bench wipe deck. There are only four things you need to know. Okay, here's the quick no gramble explanation. Number one, Weezing does a lot of bench damage with its ability and its attack. The ability hurts all of your opponent's basic Pokemons between turns. So basically poisons them all between yours and your opponent's turn, and they take a damage between turns. Okay, so add that onto Splattering Sludge. It does 40 up front and 20 to everything in the back that's wounded. Ah, so you get a few attacks with this, it's gonna wound them all. So, where you get extra bench damage, the ability of Volcorna. You destroy a fine energy from your hand, you do two damage wherever you want. Add that with Weezing, and there's gonna be a lot of dead, weak Pokemon. What are they doing with the strong Pokemon? Well, if they're wounded, this 230 is gonna become lethal. Because 230 is very close to 270, and you do have the extra softening damage. And that's how you get that. Finally, the energy cost. Luckily, everything can be paid with Welder. And the Welder engine's easy. Get cards that get you Welder. Hey, what gets you Welder? Not that card. This card gets you Welder. Find a Welder, deck seven cards. And recycle Welder from your discard. Welder, 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 Welder. You got the energies to fight. That's the main combo. Yeah, so that's that's it. Let's get out there and kick some. Hits or tails, donkey. I don't know. This is hot. I got it again. Nice. Two, two, two times on a row streak. Go, go play my cover. This is Ultra Necrozma from Pokemon. Oh man, I forgot which one. I uh, know it's the Sun and Moon one. Yeah, Pokemon Sun and Moon. There we go. Now we're on Sword and Shield. Now you gotta play that. I have the game on my desk right there. I'll start soon. Alrighty then. So, what are we gonna use for our draw? Let's go ahead and get this down here and get the maximum amount of energy. Now, what do you not need? All these are useful. I think the switch is gonna be the weakest one because you don't need a switch right now. Well, everything in here is a lot of a lot of value. But the thinner is a good one. But hey, man, this can get you a silver light next turn. Hey, man, you got silver eyes right there. Do you need that third energy? No, 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 no. Silver eyes already on hand. I can't really fill my bench here. I think I just got the pass. Alternatively, I'm gonna. Be a little bit riskier. I want to go for as much bench damage as possible now. So I'm gonna go for a coughing here. So this potentially can screw me over from attacking at all next turn. I could have got a Silvi, right? You Silvi was saying, why don't you trade it off so I can get more stuff down? A, a potential bigger setup. It's gonna be risky though because I'm gonna welder. It's gonna be riskier. Oh, I could play the last energy. I don't know what I'm doing here, man. Yeah, you can play the last energy there. All right. Don't even like some DBC songs. Remind me, I have a forgetful memory when I'm streaming talking through that, but I do have some DBC songs that we can play. All right. So, so try to hit me with chat, because I might look at it after the game over. All right. Let me get some water here. Hydrate. Watch my opponent set up. He needs to set up as many AKs as possible, and he's doing a good job of that. And bench damage will really rock this if I can get this going. If I can get this going. So let me see if we don't get Silver Eye because I used a more riskier uh, coffin setup. And uh, whatever. 
So both still light. Any of these evolved, it's going to be a very good thing for me. Oh, corn, that's not what I need there. Let's just drop it thinner. I mean, we got... We, they're just means to an end. And we're going to weld her up. We're going to weld her the coffin up here. And the welder yeah, grabs me something awesome. And a lot of things I can hit right now. It's going to... It's going to be wheezing. That's fine. One energy back here. Let's go. Let's go. Bench damage yourself. Oh, corner. you're supposed to be the star of the deck here. I'm sorry, but we'll get you up soon. We, we just haven't anything to evolve you yet. We got these guys here. Take that KO there. Weakness damage, and then you can put the four damage anywhere. Doesn't matter. Losing of Inke up front is kind of bad. I'm gonna go for. Gonna split up like this. Oh, that's strange. Right, giant hearth. So uh, hopefully the next turn we get some Volcornus to the bench. And then get the bench damage down to everything. So this deck is very weak to bench wipe. And I want you in and on to Volcornus GX. I want you to do something, at least anything here. So we could be doing bench damage with our attacks, bench damage with our abilities, throwing love and fire energies and wiping up this deck here. So going first, having this good setup was very, very nice here. So he's gonna put energy here, which is weird, but that's okay. And puts energies in this card, I get it. And it gives him more pulls with Lily. Yeah, Lily got the draw some cards. Last card you have, the more cards you get. Hi, Crosby! Good to see you! Welcome, welcome. I think that I'm an important person here. I know. Hi, Crosby. Alright. Anything he puts down. Oh my gosh. Let's see, he's got a Mew. Bench barrier, so we cannot do bench damage. Everyone's gonna Mew today. Alright, what are we gonna do? We can't do bench damage, but our passive is gonna be doing a lot here. So my goal right now is I need some Volcornas to kill this Mew. It'll take about. With one Volcorna three turns, with two of them two turns. So hopefully we get a bunch going. We're just gonna straight Cynthia this right here, too. And passively, I can do a bench damage, but not. They'll not even have to attack right there. Alright, so just Cynthia this stuff. Find those basic Pokemons. Drop those basics down, Donald. Okay, that'll do. So I'm gonna try to dump everything off my hand here. No, I need nothing here. I need nothing. So I can get an extra pull. Technically I need a Volcorna off this, but I need more than Volcorna. Yeah, let's just dump our hand here. Reset stamp up, give you more cards? I don't think so. So I'm just going to destroy the reset stamp like this. These are really good, so I can't lose them. So let's just pull a three-card pool. Come on, Volcorn, it's your deck. Come down here and play with me. Well, I need the basic versions of you. Darn it. Bathroom Splash, just look at this here. But the uh, bench damage is going to hurt here. All right. Bench damage is nice, but you need to get out under the action, buddy. You need to get out of here. All right. That's Dale's the type debut. Well... The whole goal of this deck is to make him shine, but right now his buddies, his buddies are doing a good job carrying him here. Alrighty then. So Mew's gonna die passively in about three turns as well because of Weezing special effect here. So we just need Volcorn to show up. Fortunately, yeah, I need more basics down. I might, let me see, let me see, Mew, Psychic, Psychic, Fire. Uh, Professor Oak would not be a bad idea for this. I think I'm gonna go ahead and try to add two, two Professor Oaks here. Yeah, look at this bench. They're asking, play professors. Oh, the. Oh. Okay. I don't even need to attack next turn. Volcorna, come out here. Do flaming shots. Although, wheezing Volcorna is not bad. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Maybe I should take the Silvali out. The Silvali is not bad for the. He's okay for the draws. He's not drawing much here. I might take. Go get for the fourth old corner. It's gonna be all. Yeah, it's gonna be all out. Something else. I might do that. Okay. Let's see what you got here. Mim Hugh gonna come out. You can do filch for two extra cards. He's got. He's got. We got no pressure coming on here. He's looking for. Yeah. Oh, he can do copycat. Splattering sludge. Weakness damage. That's gonna hurt a lot. But not dead. Alrighty then. This Mew's dead in the next. Maybe the the next turn. There we go. That's gonna be some stuff. Let's get our supporter here. We'll see what we get. Never mind. We get nothing here. Uh, might as well just dump the energy somewhere, right? It can fight, and we can draw two more cards here. You're not bad. Not bad, Silverly. That's a guaranteed Volcorn. Uh. So I. That's a guaranteed Volcorn. I would be tempted to get another baby Volcorn down, but that's a guarantee. Guarantee Volcorn. 
I'm going to be greedy. Bye, Corner GX. I'm going to get Larvesta out. Because I can get two of them. I'm greedy. I want the best. And I'm going to just use this one of draws here. Let's attack. 40 damage. And then the bench damage comes through everywhere. And the Jirachi finally goes down. Okay, that's a Volcorna. We can snipe stuff off here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Volcorna can be doing some damage here. Knock out the Mews. Knock out... Not the Malamars. Knock out the Mimikyus. Anything. Gotta throw down Spell Tag attack. Now, we... Okay, we, if we Volcorna this, it doesn't take... That's gonna be bad for him. Alright! Two hits. We're gone. By you. Now, I could get a, try to get a Weezing here, too. I could potentially drop a Weezing on here, that that would wipe out a lot. Two Pokemon instead of one. But now we're getting two KOs next turn, no matter what. So don't worry about it. Just attack with a Silph Light, get two KOs. Volcorna is going to get in on the action. Take out the two prize cards for me, and that's going to put me very close to winning here. Yep. Alright, we're going to KO this. Donald, did you forget to play Dragon Ball Z? I think I did. All right. Let's see what's going on here. Tackle! Cynthia! Megalopunny! Uh-oh. Megalopunny is real good. Really, really nice. Puts a lot of nice pressure on the uh, GX decks. All right, Mimikyu it is! What do you have? Shutting off abilities. Oh, no, that you shut down my civilized effect. So here it is, Shadow Box. If a GX has damage, it can't... There's no abilities. And this thing got shot. So I don't get any draws next turn as expected. Oh, not bad. Not bad. He's got Malmar combo, but I, I think he's missing his Giratina. Big time missing the Giratina and some Malmars. All right, then. There you go, Weezing. His first prize guard. Why does this take some damage? Oh, because of the extra effect. All right. So here we go. We are going to go ahead and Cherish Ball. Get one Volcorda up. Volcorda may have to start fighting, so we'll use this to evolve. Actually, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let me see how many energies here. Definitely could just use that Fire Crystal right here. Can't draw right now. I'm just gonna have to fight with what I have. Potentially, you might have to fight here. So, we'll put energy. We go ahead and put energy on you. Now, let's go ahead and use the Rocket Launcher here. I don't want to take extra damage, so I'm taking off this Mimikyu right now. And it will not trigger this spell tag. Because it got shot off by the ability and not normally. Alright, and that's a supporter! So we get to do, it's not instead of 50 damage, a lot more. And he's gonna give up the Mew too, so we're gonna go with Cynthia. We use the second effect here because it gives me more cards. And I can just recycle these energies. Welder! Yay! And three more draws! And that's another Volcorda! Yay! Oh man, that is good! So now I can go ahead and do this. Activate your ability and kill the Mew off. Here we go, flaming shot, that's another prize card! Yay! Okay. Alrighty then, that's another prize card. We got fiery crystals, and I don't need that fire crystal right now. I'm gonna send that out instead. Uh, and I could just go ahead and dump stuff up for draws, right? I mean, there are plenty of supporters in my hand. Here's more rockets for you. And we already played a supporter, let's go ahead and do brave buddies. Take that out. I have three prize cards in a single turn, baby. We now have 40 damage that go onto the bench here, too. So that is looking awesome. Wow. Wow. Wow, we. Wow, we. Do we need a soul lie? Not really. Just get. Just take a. Okay. No attacks trigger spell tags? Yes, but I used a ability, so it does not trigger spell tag. This is. This, this ability killed it. Flaming shot killed it, and it was not a regular attack. And I didn't want to take 40 damage, but I thought that was the best way to do it, so. Alrighty then. We just need to attack, and I don't think there's anything here that has enough damage to do, uh, that can survive Brave Buddies here. So, I am just gonna shoot. We have a big prize, which is way too far to lose here. I think it's gonna be game. It's gonna be, yeah. The bench damage was awesome. Bench damage was awesome. All right! So, what do you have? You have to survive 120 damage from Brave Buddies. And I have everything here. He might reset stamp me. That could win the game. That could save him right now, if you can get a reset stamp. Because I can't draw, and I won't have the damage to kill you if I don't get a supporter. Right now, my hand, you just need to get rid of my supporters through a reset stamp. Reset stamp could win you the game. Alright. 
Federico Tex. Shut up here. So far, I think I'm not. This silver line hasn't been drawn me. There we go. There we go. That's gonna be a good game, uh, Federico. Uh, he didn't have any uh, pressure, any damage come through. Nothing to take brass guards this time. Yeah. We'll see. Okay, next game. Yeah, I'm gonna go first. First match with a bench damage Volcarona attack. Ah, no Pokemon. That's a good. That's not a bad hand though. Lots of energies. You should go well though with that instead of a Cynthia here. All right, let's see what we got here. We got a Charizard. That is not the right deck. That's not the deck I made. So okay, you know what? It'll be, it's a Charizard with the Volcarona deck, which seems to make sense. Well, I, I'll keep playing this. I'll keep playing this. Okay. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, Charizard. Let's go. You got. You get the big damage, you get a wealth, you got also a giant hearth there, so we can attack with Outrage the first turn. And after that, it's gonna go crazy. You know what? This Charizard's better for setting up Volcorna. Here we go. Let's go ahead and play some music now. This is gonna be my cover of Honey Loo Escape. Check it out, Spotify, if you like it. From Super Mario Odyssey. Alright, what do you not want? Let's drop Cynthia and... This potentially could be something good. It could be another welder. That would be the best thing here, so... Let's go ahead and get this up here. And we are gonna charge not the front one up. We're gonna charge the back one because the back one is a bit stronger. I didn't draw it till later too. All right, there's my switch right there. There's another energy, and this could be this could be a draw. Yeah, we could totally just play Cheese Master this turn right here too. But you know what? I'm, I'm potential. Hey, this is not a bad hand. We can try Cheese Master next turn. So attack all. Should get me a switch. I have not looked through my deck this uh, once yet, so I don't know what's in the prize, what's not. And, uh, how's Volcorna? This is a Volcorna deck, just to remind you. This is supposed to show off Volcorona's damage. Which is not doing that, that, that great of a job there. Raisin, thank you for the bits! Start me off! Yay! Thank you! Thank you for 100 bits. Speaking of which, I Pokemon Sword and Shield came out. And we haven't started that yet. Ah! Haven't I've been, been busy lately. Alright, so here's where I can one-shot this. If I fight with this. All right, gonna come out right away with that. Maybe to use Outrage. All right, so let me see. We need a switch right now. And I can tag call with a switch and get some damage in right there. So there we go. There's Mala Lano. <laughs> Lana and Malo. Got the other reverse there. And let's just go ahead and play... Get to grab Cynthia next here, too. So what is just a means to an end? This is just a means to an end. Gonna go ahead and take that. Grab the end cheese. What I mean is that's just a thinner. That's not the actual thing. The actual thing will, means I would permanently lose it, so... Let's go ahead and Malo and... Yeah, that's right. Malo and Lana. We don't need to heal anything up. Let's go get that switch up there. Now, I can potentially take prize, two prize cards. Or I can save it for later. You know what? Two prize cards? Let's go. Great catch of that. Giant Hearth, I mean, I think that's gonna stay there. I'm gonna go ahead and take this here. And take that two prize, because that's two more cards in my hand. We're gonna do Brilliant Flare! Alright, so let's go ahead and set up another Volcanion. Would you like to search, set up your deck up? Yeah, give me, give me a Volcanion. Give me a Welder, too. Give me a Welder. Give me these basics, and give me a Welder. By the way, taking out, the, I only got one more Welder left in my deck. That sucks. All three Volcanions are here. But having energies for the next Pokemon is going to be big here. So that's why we did that. All right. And then we can... I don't think I can... This Charizard is a little too weak. We need this Charizard to get the one shot at this. And who can do that with Volcanion. But doesn't need to do that, so... All right. So he potentially... He can't He can't KO me. He has no Volcanions himself. He trans as well. Okay. What's in the kitchen today? It's supposed to be Volcarona. Helping out this Charizard out with the damage, but this Charizard's helping the Volcarona set up right now. So it's in the progress here. It is in progress. We used up one great catcher. I, sh I don't know if the last one's a prize. Definitely could just go get another Cheese Master up and he's like, ah! All right, so that turn one, I think I go into first. Yeah, turn one advantage is nice. But Donald, this is supposed to be Volcarona that deck. Then we can kill maybe Cheese Master and this off the bench. That would be pretty funny. That would be pretty awesome, not funny. Actually, it'd be both. Alright, but they won't set up to next turn. There's no Volcorno going in here. 
All right. Fire. Oh, okay. He took away that. Oh, he used both the same at once. So this is already eating a lot of energies up here. Now he's getting set up. And Volcora, soon they'll set up and soon they might be able to take a snipe. Uh, nothing for now. All right, so this thing is 20 damage. It's gonna be, it's not gonna be dead. There's no way it's gonna die next turn. So definitely, definitely, definitely just set up a new Charizard out here. Um, let me see what I can do here. I could get the another welder back. Let's get welder here. Yeah, let's get those energies. Get some draws here. Get this guy up right here. So a lot of energies are being backed up in my deck right now. Okay. Let's go ahead and Pokemon Communications. We're going to set up a full Volcorn uh, bench here. There we go, baby. All right, that's it. I'm out. I'm going to go ahead and do Brilliant Flare again. I cannot die next turn unless... Unless you surprise me somehow. Would you like to search your deck for cards? Yeah, get all the Volcornos out here. And we're out of energies. No, we're not. We got three energies left. I already have something, lots of things that can grab me energies here. So we can get the maximum damage of Volcornos next turn. Yeah, there we go. Okay, this is kind of looking like a Volcorna deck. Yeah, now that they're all evolved up, we can start firing missile launchers to the other side. To the back line if we need to. We don't need to at all. So I can take this, once I take that down, I just need one more prize card, so we'll just snipe off, for the little, snipe off the bench for the last kill, somehow. 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 Hopefully this doesn't evolve, and then I can get some extra damage. Ah, you know what? We're in a good spot. We are in a good spot. Gonna evolve that nine tails right away. Okay, well... This has to run right now. We might be able to even snipe it off with the Volcornos, too. So, everything's looking nice. I'm in a pretty, I'm in a pretty good spot. So we'll see. My goal today, we want to do something with this guy. We want to do something with this card, and he's not doing much here. So let me see, what do you do? I could definitely run back, and then I can just go bench snipe this off. It takes me about a few turns to do it, but definitely doable. And we got one shot everything coming through now, here now, so mm, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Three energies in my deck. I expect you to live another turn, too. Try to punish it. Oh, that's gonna give him the KO if he gets two energies in here. Not bad. Not bad at all. I wouldn't expect you to use this with a, you know, a Giant GX deck, but that does give you the kill. So this, all right, let's see if you can do it. If you can weld her with those two energies there. Okay, so you're fighting with this here. Outrage. And you're hurting on your own GXs. I'm gonna live, but I'm gonna die, okay. Let's do it. Let's go ahead and evolve. Let's get not get hurt anymore. Let's go ahead and take that out there. Victory it is! Alright, we were going to go downtown with that bench damage right down there too. Alright! But it got denied. He just forfeit before I could show you that. Uh yeah, you know what? Charizard is a Volcorno is real nicely. It doesn't lose its energies. Its energy got costs one more. Alright. Heads or tails, donkey. No, no, this is. Or close, but it has a lot. So I think this is tails. No! Oh! He's help. Today? Today, you good. You let me go first until the new supporter changes takes effect. I don't know when. But let's go. Thank you, donkey. All right. So we didn't really get to play Ultimate Battle. I'm going to play my cover. This is the Ultimate Battle from Dragon Ball Super. If you like it, please check it out. Spotify. All right. Da -da 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 we get to go first. I see the little Ultra Deck Cross my deck box. We need to play the new Ultra Deck Cross because it is awesome and sexy. Yes, it is. All right. And he doesn't work without Silent Lab or Muck. And it's gonna be Coffin up front with. I mean, we go first. We don't need an energy boost on our first turn here. Not only that. Now, oh man, I'm weak on draws here. I am very weak on draws here. I need a draw supporter. Kind of made you wish you have a silver eye. One silver eye. Is that what we want? One silver eye? Okay. Uh, it's just a look of the draw, look of the draw, Donald. I think we're okay here. 
Na, na, na. Wow, nice bench. That's good. Oh, it's another one of those. And it's a tough deck of drill supporter. Please be a welder. Oh, please be anything, actually. That's not good. I could get bricked out to death there. So, you know, if you have two Weezings on hand, might as well grab two Weezings. Fortunately, there's just not... We don't have any Pokemon second come out and draw here. So let's just go ahead and do that. I don't think it's KO me in the first turn here. This would be pretty awesome if I had a Troll support. But I don't. I need a better hand at this. Yep. That's the strategy. Why would cards... Uh, they're banned and expanded or banned for a reason. Alright, come on! It's gonna be Kitlin, Cynthia, that's fine. Let's go ahead and activate that. We don't get any draw supporters from the discard, because there's none there. But we want the three extra cards for sure. I know, there's no cards in the discard. There's some energies and a welder for a future turn. Let's go ahead and get that bench damage going, baby. Put that down. Potentially could have thrown that energy off, but I don't need that right now. We're gonna go ahead and do Splattering Spludge. Take that KO right there. Awesome. So it's now it's a wheezing deck. Bench damage is going. There is a draw support. Excellent. Gonna come out, but he definitely can't attack right now. There's no way he can get this. Well, he can with a complex combo. He can attack with a complex combo, but I don't think so. And if he did, that would suck for me. All right, so we're both stuck here. Let's go ahead. You know what? I don't need the energies right now. This thing is easy to charge up, especially if it's accidentally living longer than expected like this. Let's go ahead and set up more Larvestas and stuff here. Yeah, there we go. And you can find next. Don't even need an energy bonus here. That's good. Let's go ahead and do Splattering Spludge. Dude, bench damage. Wipe this out. Another attack. Actually, we don't even need to attack. He's going to get wiped. He needs another bench buckle right now. We're taking three prize cards the next turn here. Metal, so gear... No, 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 you're not gear, Tina. You might be Ultra, Ultra Necrozma. There we go. There we go. There's that Ultra Necrozma. And get Jirachi up. So he is being very, very late with the setup here. With no draw supporters coming through. So I think I'm going to be just way too ahead to here. If Volcora is going to be up next turn, we're going to see 20 damage fly through here. It's going to be awesome. There it goes. So this is dead. I get a free prize card the next turn. And I actually get two prize. I win the... Oh, I don't win next turn. Actually, I might win next turn. I might win. But this has to be out for me to take a prize card this turn. There we go. So if I activate the ability, I get a KO right here, but I don't have the damage to take him out. I don't have a retreat right now. So we evolve this right here. And let's see what we get with this prize card. Actually, activate this effect right there. No, no, no. I got, I got Pirate Crystal. Let's go ahead and do the... Wait, what are you doing? I should get one more. I'm not I'm not paying attention. I should have gotten an extra, extra energy. Let's do this here. Alright, there it goes. Another prize card for me. Slow down, Donald. Another lot of that stuff. Even more bench damage coming through. But I can't get the KO. Even with Fire Crystal, I, if I have a retreat, then I might. If I have a retreat, then I might get a KO. That might come with a welder. Very maybe because I might win. I'm going to weld this. I have plenty of energy right there. I don't get it. That's fine. That's fine. Splattering Sludge. Resistance. Uh, you're going to live. You're going to live, but we have a ton of bench damage that could come through with this hit combo like this. All right. I've seen that scissor rainbow energy a lot. Actually, YouTube. I think people are getting it from a certain from a radio. TCG or radio. We might try it out. It's it's an okay strategy. It's a two-shotting. It's a two-shot build. With Persian TX. So, you know, we might do it later. Okay. Great catcher up. That's fine. You want to fish me out? I'm not... Maybe you have a lily or something. That's why you're a little fishing for that. Because uh, maybe he wants to avoid the bench damage. Because the bench damage is a lot. And the lily. I was correct both times. All right. So we can attack. Lily it is. He's like, I'm still in this, Donald. Don't put me out. Write me off off yet. All right. More but, but more down so we can get a lot of bench damage going. Uh-huh. No, I technically could just play an energy to retreat so I can maximize the bench damage. And I don't... Yeah, we got we got tons of fire crystals in our deck. We're fine. We have two Volcornas. We got Weezings. I like this. I like this bench damage real better. All right. Go to Switch. He's like, okay, take this out. Well... That means I get a KO right here. 
And I get a KO right here. I get two kills next turn. This turn. This turn. I get two kills this turn. Let's go ahead and do that. And I'm gonna go ahead and try to get... Let me see if I can get another Volcorda up. That is correct. I can get another Volcorda up. So I'm gonna try to maximize my damage here by taking this out. He is in a lot of trouble. Alright, let's do this. Pop this out. Pop a Cynthia. We'll pay the energy to retreat. There's a fire... Oh, okay, Switch is being better. So, Poke Gear. Let's go ahead and draw that Poke Gear out. Because it's just a means to an end. And then we can fire a Crystal... Well, we haven't used that much here. All right, let's go ahead and what are we gonna do? With this? How are we gonna do this? How are we gonna do this? We're gonna uh, do some math. We're gonna do flaming shot. To do damage right here, so we can kill it. All right, we're gonna do flaming shot again, so this thing dies. And that's gonna be it. I think there's three energies in hand. I'm gonna get them into my hand immediately for the next turn. Alrighty then. So why attack? No, I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna maximize the bench damage done right here. I'm gonna keep the energies on hand. I don't need anything. We're gonna do a splattering splodge. Take that KO back there. And then that thing dies at the end of the turn, so that's two prize cards. Yep, there we go. Another one right there. Bench wiping is like, ah! Volcorna and Weezing, that is a ton of bench damage. A ton, a ton, a ton of bench damage. Good thing you're not playing against GXs, because that would be a little bit harder. Well, the, we got Volcorna's big stab giant dance damage right there. So, why should you get named Blue Dolphins? Because one of the company employees named it that way. 